also very oftenly asked question that uh, what students should uh, uh, decide after their four lives uh, four year lives in uh, after doing the btech because some uh, students prefer going for research some students prefer going for job so what are the other career options after completing the btech Uh, uh, in CS, uh, most of the people opt for placement, and uh, you know, like if you are choosing a CS in some college, I think your uh, goal will be most probably placement only. And as it all, uh, placements are very nice. And uh, like some other options that students generally choose here is uh, going for M Tech in IITs, uh, like by writing GATE. so that is also one one thing and for gate like you'll be as i told the faculty is very good so there is no need to take another coaching at all if you uh, properly attend the classes and do self study that is uh, more than enough for you to crack uh, the gate and get good rank uh, there is uh, no need of external coaching at all so for gate also you'll be finding uh, uh, peers around you and other thing and if you want to do uh, higher studies in foreign so there are lot of uh, your seniors uh, are doing the same thing so you can find about them in linkedin and you can ping them they'll be very much happy to help you they'll be explaining you all the process that you need to do to get into that particular college and uh, they'll guide you uh, how you have to uh, choose the subjects and all uh, and uh, if you want to do masters in foreign also and uh, like if you want to do research uh, if you get that i mean uh, if you feel that cs is really interesting and you want to contribute something then uh, that is also there uh, you can uh, very much go to research also and like and uh, i think here also in placements also you will be offering some uh, uh, r&d roles also research and development roles i think you can uh, opt for those companies and uh, go there and uh, do the research and uh, contribute to the community so uh, hope for best that uh, you would get in this college and uh, a very good uh, team of your uh, uh, so I means seniors are also there so they will be also helping you okay sir so one of the very common question that uh, in out of 7 days you have classes for only 5 days so and uh, in that 5 days also only classes for 7 to 8 hours maximum so rest of your life will be spent in the college campus itself and uh, among your friends so how is the college life of uh, ist sipur and uh, tell about your experiences also and what the things which our juniors will be coming they will be getting so please tell us about that and like in your free time so whatever may be your interest you will always find some guys doing the same thing here whatever it may you are may be interesting like in you are interested in dancing singing literature even some uh, coding and hackathons whatever it may be so you will be finding some guys doing the same thing so uh, there are lot of events conducted in the college every little thing is celebrated here and uh, a lot of lot of events so that will help you to uh, excel your communication skills even so that will also help you in placements in another way but uh, uh, like in free time like there will be uh, almost uh, uh, like there will be lot of events in the college so you can involve in them and take part uh, take uh, part in them and uh, i think the college has a very good greenery and you can roam in the college so that will actually relieve you uh, if you have a work pressure even so very good campus you can have a very good time here and there are lot of events you will not be bored at all so each and everything will be celebrated here and uh, like even if you uh, want technical events those also there so you can uh, participate in uh, each and every technical uh, event and there is no restriction at all like uh, e- only cs department students are allowed and only boys are allowed so all, all those restrictions are not there there is no discrimination in each and every event anyone can participate and uh, like you can explore in whatever interest you have Okay, sir. So you talked about the technical events. So uh, could you please explain a bit more about it? Because uh, uh, it's uh, it keep the college younger, as uh, compared to the our uh, only theoretical and uh, labs. Uh, technical events also uh, has a huge impact on our life. So please uh, tell us about. Uh, please tell us more about it. Yeah. Uh, so every year in the college, uh, there will be two technical fest. 
uh, one is the technical fest that is called instro and uh, one is cultural fest that is called rebecca uh, so instro is a technical fest so those who want to participate in uh, all the technical competitions so this is a very good uh, like a platform for you in each and every uh, department in each and every domain there will be one participation so almost i think more than 30 to 40 uh, events will be there in that uh, three days of technical fest and you can participate in uh, as many ev events as you want and uh, there will be a very good uh, gifts also and uh, there will like you can also uh, organize some event and uh, you can invite the uh, students to part take part in that uh, like apart from the intro in normally also there will be a lot of events going on uh, every week every 10 days so uh, even you can find some competitions about coding some competitions about uh, uh, doing web development app development those kind of things and also some kind of uh, like if, if you talk about other departments there are some uh, competitions related to robotics and also all those things will be there and uh, technical events there is no problem at all you will be finding uh, uh, each and every event that you want to participate in Okay, sir. So thank you for explaining all about the technical events. Now, uh, one of the very means uh, it's a kind of complaint type of question that <laughs> about the mess facilities and the food hostels, since uh, it is a government college. So the things are not as you will expect from your home. So please tell us about the hostel. Uh, mess and the food since you are from the uh, uh, you are from south so you might face uh, many difficulties because that taste you can't get here Mo also you can't get uh, the taste which you get at your home so tell about the all these things mess food uh, and uh, mess food uh, hostels and uh, the food okay so like uh, if you talk about the ho hostels uh, like all the constructions are little bit old that you have to compromise here so as this college is really old so all the uh, i mean constructions are uh, from the time of british and uh, uh, like you s see that ev each and every hostel is very old so that is one complaint over here and but apart from that the rooms and the hostels are decent don't put much expectations or high expectations on this but uh, the hostels rooms and all uh, are decent and if you talk about the mess and uh, like here you will be getting uh, each and every bengali food and also sometimes uh, uh, weekly once or twice you will be finding south food also like all over india like in every week you will be finding one food from your place so it's not a completely bengali food but uh, you'll be finding mixture of them but mostly you'll be getting bengali only as this college in west bengal uh, but if you don't like in mess you can you have very much like all those options available uh, nearby there are a lot of restaurants also there as this college in the in the uh, city of haura itself not in the outskirts so you'll be getting all the required uh, uh, necessities over here in nearby and uh, if you once uh, get used to the mess over here and then you will not be facing any issue so it will take time uh, i i think it took six to seven months for me to get adjust here and uh, after that i i didn't face any issue uh, like if you ask me about the hostels and mess in overall uh, they are decent don't expect uh, don't don't put much expectations okay sir so uh, since kolkata is one of the oldest uh, city and uh, in uh, during british period it was the first city which was uh, means uh, well beautified so there are much more things to roam, ar uh, roam around in kolkata and outside also like uh, other temples also so please tell us that uh, af uh, after studying that much if you get bored or if you want to roam about because four years you are going to spend so what are the places is uh, places Places that a student can uh, visit and uh, about your experiences also yeah one of the best thing like uh, this college is in the middle of the country right it's not even in the north it's not even in the south so you can uh, like uh, visit any place you want in this country uh, i mean nearby also there are a lot of places uh, actually first of all uh, once you come here uh, you should explore kolkata there are a lot of places that you can find normal in uh, internet so all those uh, uh, places you can visit and you'll be enjoying them and uh, once you are done with kolkata and one uh, the next thing that you would like to see here is dasra celebrations so in country you will be uh, seeing the uh, very i mean 
wonderful celebrations in Kolkata. All the pandals and all so really amazing. You will be getting a very good experience uh, uh, here in Dasra. And uh, uh, apart from that, you can uh, like uh, visit any nearby cities. Like Puri is also near from here. And uh, uh, the thing you can also go to Darjeeling, Sikkim and all. So in any direction you go, uh, you can go because this uh, uh, Kolkata is in the middle of the country almost. Okay, sir. So, uh, finally, let's moving to our the last question that uh, overall, uh, overall, overall review about the college that uh, if a student uh, could not get, unfortunately, uh, means uh, in CS department in IITs. So, where say they should put this college on an option because uh, there are much good colleges than this also if you see the rank wise, but uh, you might not get that good rank in J so you will have to opt out of these colleges also so please tell us about that overall review about of this cs department and uh, ist sipur yeah so uh, i mean once you take cs here you will not be regretting after that uh, why i have chosen C cs here but this is a very good department in this college uh, i think uh, i'll recommend if you are getting cs over here you definitely like uh, uh, i mean uh, consider it i mean uh, and also it's a top six uh, uh, nit in nirf ranking this year uh, like if you are getting or uh, the top five colleges uh, in cs you can take them but uh, if you are not then you can consider this this college has a very good uh, uh, history and uh, you'll be having very good alumni like wherever you go you will be finding alumni of this college because uh, this college is very old and also uh, this college is not modern uh, i mean uh, in the terms of architecture so you'll be uh, finding uh, the old constructions if some if you are a guy who likes all these kind of things then uh, this is a very good place for you and there is a lot of greenery over here in this college uh, i think overall uh, i will rate 4.5 out of uh, 5 for the CS department in IST Shippur. So very good option to consider. Okay, sir. So very nice meeting of you. And uh, I would like to firstly congratulate you the one, uh, for getting a very good CTC and placement and uh, hope very good for your future. Thank you, sir, for coming on our channel. Yeah, uh, thank you so much. Thank you so much, Sajjit Pratap. And uh, also, uh, I'm very happy to meet you guys. And uh, like, hope you uh, see you soon here. Yeah, bye-bye.